Hello, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to put your Mazda into maintenance mode. We're going to be performing this on the 2016 Mazda CX-9, but this process is similar and will work for most every Mazda with electronic parking brakes. Performing this step retracts your parking brake motors, allowing you to safely replace your rear brake pads. This way you'll avoid damaging the motors themselves when compressing your caliper pistons. Well, let's get right to it. First, we'll start with the vehicle in the off position. Now with your foot off of the brake pedal, we press the start button twice. This will put us into ignition on mode and all the dash lights will illuminate at this point. Now we're gonna press and hold the accelerator pedal all the way down. While continuing to do so, we'll also press and hold the parking brake button down. So as we continue to hold those, we're gonna press the start stop button three times. This will turn the ignition off and then back on. If done properly, the parking brake motors will begin to retract, but you don't wanna let go just yet. Not until you hear the motor stop. This will also illuminate this electronic parking brake warning light, verifying that we are in maintenance mode and it is safe to work on your rear brakes. So you can go ahead and turn off the ignition mode by pressing the start button one more time. Now once you've completed the rear brake pad replacement and everything is put back together, we're ready to remove maintenance mode. Once again, we'll turn the ignition on by pressing the start button twice. Again, we're gonna press and hold the accelerator pedal all the way down. At the same time, this time we're gonna pull up on the parking brake button and hold it there. While holding those down, we'll press the start stop button three times, continuing to hold the pedal and the switch. At this point, you should hear the motors once again as they adjust themselves to the new brake pads. Once you hear them stop, we can release both the accelerator pedal and the parking brake button. The icon on the dash should now be off as well, indicating that we are off of maintenance mode, thus completing this process and this video. Well, I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If so, please click that thumbs up button to support my video and my channel, and please subscribe if you haven't done so.